If you want to learn the ins and outs of Audacity so that you can record, edit, and mix like an audio pro, then you're in the right place. This is Audacity Accelerator, the full course that I've put together for you right here on YouTube. It's the only course that you need to quickly and simply learn everything you need to know about how to create music, podcasts, and more using the fantastically simple and free software Audacity. Hey everyone, Joe here. Welcome to the Audacity Accelerator course. In this first part, I'm gonna explain exactly what Audacity is and everything that it can do. We'll then move on to how to install the software, how to set it up, and how to get recording, editing, and mixing of different types of audio. And finally, I'll go over how to export your audio into the right formats, and then there'll be an extra couple of bonus videos at the end with some extra tips and tricks to help you. And there are 21 videos in this series in total, one coming out every single day. So hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of them. Or if you're watching after release, you'll find all the videos ready there in the playlist. I'll link that on the screen uh, so you can jump to whichever vi videos are most relevant to you. Now this course is mostly focused towards beginners, but even if you do know your way around Audacity, it's definitely worth watching to get to pick up some extra tips and tricks and also just a, a refresher. And at the end of the course, I'll be sharing something super useful with you that you can download for free that will help continue your learning after the course and help to speed up your workflow. Now let's get to it. So if you're not already familiar with what Audacity is and what it does, it's a free, open source, easy to use digital audio workstation software uh, that's available for PC, Mac and Linux. And like all digital audio workstations or DAWs or DAWs, whatever you want to call them, it lets you record audio, edit audio, mix, uh, master audio, and export in a number of different file formats. It can be used for editing podcasts, mixing music, recording demos for, for your band, uh, recording over backing tracks, recording audio for video, all the audio basics it has you covered. Audacity is a fantastic piece of audio software. I'm not endorsed by them at all, it's free anyway. Um, but if you're a beginner, just starting out to learn the ropes of recording or you just need to do some basic tasks, it can be fantastic for learning to get your head around the, the whole recording process and, and the, the general layout of a digital audio workstation. The skills are transferable to the more sort of high-end digital audio workstations. Now I use Pro Tools for, for most of my audio work um, but even even still, I, I tend to use Audacity sometimes anyway, just, just for its simplicity and its speed for, for certain tasks. So you might just be using Audacity as a starting point um, for your music maybe, and you might be thinking about moving to towards something else later. But for some tasks like recording and editing podcasts, for example, Audacity could, could fare you well for a very long time. So now that you know exactly what Audacity is, uh, what it does and why you should use it, it's time to find out how to download and install Audacity, which is what we're gonna be going over in part two. So hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so you're notified when the next part is up. Leave a like if this video helped you and let me know in the comments section below, what are you gonna be using Audacity for? And as always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in part two.